Hey guys, today we're gonna to be reviewing the new Buff Bunny collection, which you are not ready. If you haven't seen a lot of these pieces yet, they're incredible. Echo wanted to join the video today, so if you guys don't know Echo, here he is. <laughs> These pieces are so beautiful, so comfortable, and exactly what you would expect from Buff Bunny on a level of quality and comfort. So I haven't tried on every single piece yet, so we're gonna be doing a full try on haul, and I'll be going over everything that's launching in what colorways and my preferred sizing, and also be going over the compression levels of different items to show you like what would be more or less supportive, more or less compressed. But just to start out, everything that's launching on Saturday. So we're looking at three sports bras, a few different tops, multiple different kinds of leggings, and shorts too. I've been looking forward to the white and black set ever since I saw Heidi wearing it. I love the look of it and like the contour and they also came out with it in a few different colors. So in my last try on video I got all size small bottoms and all size medium tops and trying them on I was like man you know what I would really prefer a size medium in virtually all of the bottoms just because I am heavier now I put on more muscle and that's just what feels most comfortable for me right now so I ended up sizing up to size medium exchanging everything from that haul and everything fits so much better so moving forward with this collection I ended up getting all size medium bottoms all size medium tops and it's just perfect so let's just start out with the top that I'm wearing right now I posted this on my Instagram story the other day and the amount of DMs I got girls asking where this top was from I feel so comfortable and confident in it but this is definitely more of a small boob top unless you don't mind to have like a ton of cleavage or spilling out a little bit at the bottom because you know I don't really have a lot of boobs I don't even know what my cup size is because I only wear sports bras me in a size medium right now I wore this during legs the other day I had absolutely no issues with like it slipping up really just sit securely right under my boob right under my under boob and I find it to be like extremely flattering. It doesn't have any lift. It's just this really buttery fabric. Like it's stretchy and it's really, really, really soft. So that's why I like it so much. It doesn't feel like you have anything on and it's really comfortable on the arms as well. Like I'm not restricted here in any way. And the best thing about this top is it is reversible. So here's the back. You do have this small logo right here. So when you wear it this way, the logo will be on the back. But if you flip it around, the logo will be on the front. So the other day when I was doing legs, I was done and I was gonna run some errands and I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna flip the top around just so it's a little bit more coverage in the front because I don't know, I just feel like this is more gym attire and then flipping it around is more just like everyday attire. Not that I would not go out in public in this because I absolutely would, I don't care. But that's just what I did the other day, which was really nice. So when I put it on here, it just slides right up. It's like, honestly, kind of like a more of a scoop neck because of the way that the back works like this. So it's really, really cute. Either way, the little twist in the back. And then when it's on like this, you have the little Buff Bunny logo, which is stitched on right here. It's like a little gem. There are no pads. It is just this really thin, it's not even, it's not that thin, but it's a very buttery soft material, very similar to the leggings, just a little bit thinner. And this is coming in a white and a black color. So it can go with like literally everything. And I love that it can be going out top or it can be a part of a gym outfit as well. So this is like something that's going to probably sell out really fast just based on how much interest I've seen in it already. So I have all of the other pieces from the collection hanging up right here. I have all of the other pieces from the collection hanging up right here. These are the pieces that I got. I am so excited to try on these outfits. This sports bra, you guys are going to go crazy over the back. And I just, I love this so much. So let's try them all on. Okay, so moving on to the leggings that I have on right now. These are so, so stretchy. They stay up so much better for me comparably to like the legacy leggings. It is hands down my favorite fabric that I have tried from Buff Bunny. And that's saying a lot because their other fabrics are fantastic too. And I've heard a few girls talk about how stay up a lot better compared to the Rosa leggings as well. Not saying those don't stay up, but they tend to roll a little bit. And these, I don't feel like I have to adjust them as much. And I honestly, because of how stretchy they are, they're giving Lululemon's like 
100%. So nice. I really like the white around the waist. I think that it makes you look a little bit more snatched. You know, it just like adds comparably to just a plain black legging, which a lot of people tend to already have. So of course there's no front seam, anything like that. The only seams are on the inside. There's no seams on the outside. And the booty contour is the white, which is so cute. You have the little logo which is very, very simple, which I love. So when I saw these, it was an absolute must for me. But once I put them on, I, I knew that I just was obsessed because of the fabric. Like it's very, very stretchy. I'm gonna go ahead and throw on this top because this freaking top is so cute. It might not be everybody's style. The shorts with the white, I think is so cute, especially with this, but it's not really my style comparably to these. I felt like I would get so much more wear out of these and the white and black top just paired perfectly with it. So that's why I went with this fit, but I do think that the new shorts that are coming out in the three different colorways are really cute too. Just not something that I would wear as much. So this is the Aurora sports bra that we have seen before. And it is ridiculously stretchy, extremely soft, like anything else from Buff Bunny. It's very high quality, very comfortable. You do have a little band at the bottom here, but it's not gonna be digging in or anything like that. You do have removable cups. So here's the sports bra on. It is so cute and so comfortable. And it is coming out in six different colorways. So if this isn't really your style with the double colors, they do have some plain sports bras coming out as well. I feel like it does like actually give my boobs like a little bit of lift, like they, are kind of there <laughs> and I really, I like that, but it's not like I'm spilling out literally anywhere. Like I don't have a lot of bulging right here. It's very comfortable and that small band that we have here is not digging in. And here's what the back looks like. And there isn't adjustable straps, but I don't feel like this is digging in at all. I have worn it and it's very comfortable. I forgot to add this in when we are looking at the compression levels of the leggings. So I felt like I could actually size down because they are so stretchy. And that's because they aren't as compressive. They're a little bit less compressive than the Legacy and the Rosa. You have like a little bit of like stomach control. I feel like they're one of my favorite fabrics and I really hope that they come out with more this outfit, again, to me, is like everything. I think that it matches so well together. I haven't even tried on these leggings yet, but I know it's just gonna look absolutely adorable. So when looking at this sports bra, this is the curved sports bra, and as soon as I saw it on the line sheet, I knew that it was going to be so cute and so flattering because of the V that comes up in the front. I'm typically not a racer back sort of sports bra girl, but this is so cute. <laughs> like, it's not too high of a neck. It's put together very, very well. So this bra is coming out in four colors. So this is the Alaska color in the curve sports bra. So it's not like too dramatic coming up in the front and it's not too high of a neck. So it's just, this was perfectly designed in my opinion, but we're all different. It fits differently on everybody. The way it fits me, I could not ask for more. This is a medium, of course, and this is a new sports bra, I believe. So I would think this is going to also be one of those things that probably sells out really quick, kind of like the twisted sports bra that we saw in the last collection that sold out very, very quickly. So this would be so cute in so many different colors too. So I hope that they continue to make different colors in this. I love that they're coming out with like a staple black and white along with the blues, which is really cute. And this even with the black and white leggings I wore the other day, so many compliments. I love it. I think it could go so well with so many different pieces. And we're looking at the pinks. Barbie, yes. Unicorn, yes. Cotton candy, everything, super cute. But I think it's going to match perfectly because it was made to go together, obviously, with these leggings because you have the exact same Alaska blue around the waistline. It's gonna just look so cute. So I'm gonna throw these on. Okay, might I also add that the first time that I put the black pair on was definitely harder to get them up comparably to, I think today is the fourth time that I'm wearing them already. Like they just slid on really nice and easy. I didn't have to pull a whole lot, but I'm getting reminded of that, putting on the blue pair right now. So I do have to kind of pull on them to get them up and into place where I like them. 
but that's just the first time around wearing them. Here is the blue. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Like I honestly feel so confident and so just snatched in this outfit. I think it is going to be so flattering on so many different skin tones. The colors are just so pretty together. So I did forget that the first time putting them on is a little bit tougher. So when I said that I could size down, that was after wearing them a few times. So I don't know if I would actually size down now putting these on because I think I just need to throw those in the wash, let them dry, and then they will kind of like not shrink up. They're kind of like, so I would stick with my original sizing for these. I shouldn't have said I would have sized down, but I forgot, I'm sorry. The Aurora leggings are coming out in three colors. So two that you saw on me and then the black, same black with the pink around the waist, which again, so cute. And again, with the little contour, very, very cute. And they are squat proof, like, they're darker colors, they're squat proof. And I feel the same way about this curved top as I did about the cloud knit reversible top that you can absolutely wear this as like a day-to-day -day top or going out top, whatever, not just as a sports bra. So I really like that. This is going to be the least supportive bra that they're coming out with. And here is the blue outfit from far away so you can kind of get a full visual of how beautiful it is. And now we're gonna do the pink. I got the top and the shorts. I don't know where I put the shorts. I think they're in my gym bag, but the top is a little bit different. The back is like this, which is so cute, so flattering and so different. Like I really, really like that. It does have removable cups. Straps are not adjustable, same sort of situation. And it's stretchy, it's buttery. It's the same Newbury fabric as like the Legacy legging. And the Legacy legging shorts, whatever, is one of like the most known buff bunny pant because of the contour on the booty. They're gonna be just a little bit more compressive than these leggings. And I find that you're, they're just like a little bit less stretchy and there's tons of colors already out in the Legacy, but they're adding three new colors to the collection now. So they're gonna be doing the pink lights, which is right here. And they're also doing the midnight navy, which is the color that I'm wearing here just without the band. And Alaska, which is the same color as my top. So here she is, the Legacy sports bra. She is so, so cute. And it's not long line. I would say it's more of a short line sports bra. I feel very secure. I don't have big boobs, but I know a lot of the girls say that this sports bra is pretty good when it comes down to compression. Here's what the back looks like. So you have the two different kinds of straps going down and the little Buff Bunny logo, of course. And I want to try this on with the blue leggings just so you can see that they're like so cute together. And here's the pink light set on me. Honestly, it's so cute. It's a very, very vibrant, just like very true pink. It is just so stunning. Let me roll closer. <laughs> Ooh. So the shorts are gonna be coming out in four colors, the leggings in three and the sports bras in four. So the only difference is the leggings aren't gonna be coming out in the green lights color, which I'm kind of kicking myself for not getting that color now because of how good it's looking on everybody. It is such a beautiful green. I mean, I can still get it. I wish I had it to show you guys how pretty it is in this video. Very, very pretty. And I don't feel like there's too much compression around like my quads. Like it wasn't impossible to pull them up like some brands are and they are full length on me. I'm five foot eight and a half. So I do have a lot of length. And of course the booty contour is beautiful. Say hello to my tripod, but like, hmm. Beautiful. So here's the outfit from far away. So you can see like the whole thing. Very, very cute, of course. I love the back of the sports bra. I think it's just a little different and it's really, really cute. And I don't know how necessarily squat proof these would be with 
dark underwear on. But like, I just, I don't wear underwear to the gym. Some people may think that's weird. A lot of people do it, but a lot of people don't like doing it. So if anything with lighter colors, like maybe the green, the Alaska, or the pink, you might wanna be wearing a nude thong. So the only items that I didn't get from this launch are the Recycle Crew pullover. Felt like skipping it. I have so many pullovers right now. Scrunchies, headband. So the Curb Short, a lot of people are saying that they feel like it's a shorter inseam than the Legacy 4-inch shorts, for example. They say that they, it rolls a little bit more and just seems shorter, even though it is marked as a 4-inch inseam. But as always, they have a really good size chart. So if you like don't know your sizing or you haven't shot from them before, I would definitely recommend checking out their size chart. If I would have done that ahead of time, I would have realized that I am absolutely a size medium and I'm very comfortable in a size medium. And we also have the curved legging coming out that I don't have unfortunately to try. And it says that it is a light compression. So even less compressive than the Aurora leggings. And I kind of wish I would have got them because if it's lighter compression than that, that tells me that they are just going to be like thin, buttery, and really, really stretchy, which I love. Because it does say that those are good for like lounging, light workouts, hot girl walks, but maybe not so much for lifting. I personally have never tried the Rosa legging. Just from what I have heard, it is very, very similar to the Legacy legging, which is the pink that I have on right now, but you do not have that like booty contour. They're still contoured, it's just you don't have the multiple different stripes going up the glutes, which really accentuates them. And the only color that these are coming out in for this launch is the ombre. I'm not so much an ombre girl, but when I saw, oh, what's her name? Uh, one of the models wearing this, it's just, it's beautiful, Bailey. It looks really good on her. So just finishing up, here's a picture of all of the different colors launching and all of the different fabrics. If you're interested in that, you can pause and read. And really the only changes that they made this collection are the Legacy sports bra. So they changed the back and they made it a little bit more short line. So it said it'll be a little bit less coverage for bustier girls as well. So that's something to keep in mind. And the butter fabric that the Aurora stuff is in, Mwah. So I hope this video helped you guys out and got you excited for the launch on Saturday. I'll put all of the deets right here. Of course, Code Danielle saves and it supports. So if you guys use it, thank you so much. And please let me know how you like your stuff. Like send me pics on Instagram, tag me if you want to. My favorites by far are the Curve Sports Bra. Like I just think it's going to be flattering on everybody. And it's so extremely comfortable and stretchy. And of course the Aurora Sports Bra and the Aurora leggings. Like I just think they're so cute, so comfortable, and I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of them as well. And this cloud knit reversible top, like even with the pink, it is so cute and it's, it's just so soft. But you can't go wrong with anything. Like the legacy is beautiful, all of the stuff dropping you know you're gonna get something that's high quality, beautiful, comfortable. And remember that they have a really good exchange program too. If something that you get doesn't fit the way you'd want it to, you need a different size. And they do have a Canadian website too. So for all of my Canadian girls out there, make sure to shop the Canadian website so you don't have to pay any duties or fees or anything like that. If you have any questions, reach out, leave a comment, a DM.